Next one for today's good old smoke. He's um, Persian. a long hair Persian. He's really, really soft. He had, he's been shorn a couple of months ago. Um, so, yeah, we're going to shear him again today. And um, he, he doesn't like it at all. He tries to, as you can see, I can let him go. He's not even going to run away. Um, he's one of those ones that he likes me a lot. He can, Whenever I'm sitting down, he'll come and try and jump up on my lap. Um, while he's eating. Well, while I'm even trying to eat. And he knows. I say no, and he gets back down. And, um, yeah, he, he's... It's a faithful cat. He's very, very faithful. Exactly like June just said. Um, They're all faithful. He does also... Um, I'll put in a clip right here where he actually goes and chases ball. So, yeah, that'll be in right now. And also, too, um, he's ones that one of those ones where he will might bite me now because he doesn't like this being done. Uh, you can see he's cuddling me. I'm letting go, and yeah, he knows what's going on. I haven't even taken his harness off yet, and I'm still not, you know, still not letting hanging on to him. He knows what's going on. He's not a silly cat. He, they're all brainy. Um, he knows it's cold. You can feel the cold. Oh, it's still pretty cold here this morning. So, yeah. Bo's, hey, Smokey, we better get to it, eh? Hey? And they'll end up in he, bed tonight. Yeah, they'll all end up in bed tonight. He's very cringy. He, he'll go down from being a tall cat like this down to a small cat because he doesn't like the sound of the clippers he's always been like that he, he's real timid and you know around the face yeah. Any, anywhere i touch him or if i accidentally touch him too hard with the clippers he, he'll cringe and like a nervous twitch in his skin um he's always been like that and if he don't get attention, he'll bite. Yeah, if he doesn't get attention, he definitely bites you. He's, um, bit... it's, he's very affectionate. They all like the face rub. He bit me. He bit me daughter. And Garfield, you'll see him next. He bit me as well. Because I wasn't paying attention to him. So, yeah, it, it's... It's one of those things I don't like doing, shearing them, but um, we find it's quicker and easier than better than up there scratching away. The fleas actually laying eggs in their fur, and then the fleas multiply, and that's what we, you know, we try to prevent that. We've tried powders, we've tried flea tablets, we've even tried the thing on the back of the neck. Nah, hasn't worked. Uh, more because we got a better control. The way we look, the way I look at it, um, June doesn't even like me shearing them as, as well. Uh, but when it's got to be done, it's got to be done. When you've tried every every avenue for your your pet, um, it's just something that we have found that works. We keep them under control. So we'll get to start you off, smoke, okay? Hey, Moggy. Right, we'll start right into it. Face first. As you can see, he's cringing away. So I'll close his eyes like this and go straight to the neck. 
get that out of the road because that's the part he does not like one bit. I may have to change my blade because this blade's getting a bit blunt. Yep, I'll change his blade. Bear with me for a second. He's definitely the Persian because it sticks to you. Now this will be a bit shorter. Um, it's the only other blade I have for doing this. We've got to get that other one sharpened. Radio, come here, smoke. Come on. All right, let's start again. That's doing it better, isn't it, mate? Yeah. Up you go. See how he's cringing? I've got to be real careful with him here. Is that right, Matthew? Is that right, mate? Any sudden tap of the machine, I just pour it over my shoulder. I keep him up like that so I can do all of his face. Most of it anyway, underneath his chin the whole lot. Especially with this blade. Come on, mate. Very good. He's the only one that doesn't like getting it done. First time I done Garfield, he um, just laid there. I was surprised with Garfield. He's a big boy. You just gotta wait. You get, yeah. you get him. We'll get him out, and he's going to be done as well. So yes. Come on. Little good do you, Gary, mate. Go do your gaity. Do your gaity. Yes, I know. Come on, up we go. Haven't finished your front. Smokey was the left front of the litter, so we can gather. He's the smallest of the four elderly ones that we have. Um, right, I'll let your face go. I'll finish your head off. Turn your head this way, mate. Thank you. Come round. Come round. Where we go? Pretty up, pretty up. Gotta get those pockets. See, once I've got away from his chin area, it's not too bad. He's, um, pretty perceptive about the chin area. I try to do it nice and clean and tidy so they look okay. Head down mate, get all your head done. Polish it off. Here we are. Oh yeah, do this one here while I'm there. Stay there, no, stay there. I'm glad to put the paw for.
There you go, man. You want to grab the tweezers? You grab that run on, run on one while we're going. Grab that running one right there. Hey there, Mozzie. Grab him. I got the runner. Alright, we're spinning around and I'll start from the back. Or do you want to do the bottom underneath first? Because he's a bit of a hassle that way, isn't he? Uh, before we do, I'll finish that ear off. Rolls away the smoke. Over we go, mate. Here we go. Hey there. Good that he's only had one. Up the middle. Never one cat is the same. I'm being shown. He's a good boy, Mikey. Mikey's a good boy. He's yeah. a very good boy, Mum. I called June Mum because even though she's my wife, it's because of the kids. They call it classy our cats is that good. It's too old to have kids now. <laughs> our fur babies are our kids. Huh? It's nice and warm in the sun, it's not like dizzy to shear and shivering and God knows what. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Pull up the board. I am pulling the board. No, you're not. I am. Honey? I got it. No. It's there. Ah. That's how you do it, okay? You don't grab the paw, you grab there. Okay. Alright. That's a lot easier. Use that hand in the thing. Because you only need that. I had to put I have pull fur up. Shirt. Yeah, I have fur in my nose. Now I had a pour in my shirt. Mm. Mm.
looks like I'm hanging on to him pretty tightly, but no, I'm not. It's only my thumb in there. I'm not hanging on to grim life or anything like that. It's only so I can position his back leg where I need it at the time of giving his fur off. more to position it, that's all it is. And if he struggles, I've still got my thumb in there. So, it's not if I'm hanging on for a long time anyway. Gives me a chance to do the un on the other foot. On the inside as well, while I've got it like this. So I need to roll a little bit like that sort of puts me out of place. Yeah, I still haven't finished his belly anyway. Just to get me while he's like it now. Yes or no, mate. Not the best thing, is it? Yeah, I'll do the undercarriage of up underneath this back leg here when he's on the other side. Do part of his tail while we're there. Now right, I'll do his tail, too much on his feet. No, you're not getting off. Ah, got fur in my throat. Ah, fur in my throat. Did you had a fur burger? Uh, don't say that. Come on. This is Cat burger. PG rated, you know. <laughs> Come on. Not R rated. and hate life. Yeah. <clears throat> you must make me gag that. Come on, let me get in your tail. Good thing about these clippers, I can dig them into my hand and they're not cutting me. No. They're not sharp on the point, which is good. So, Smokey's handling it pretty good today, probably because you can feel the sun. You can see the heat coming up from the mountain, can't you? Yeah. Come on, give me your tail, mate. How's he finished it? You've got a great big stripe I've got to get. Give me your tail, you little bugger. Alright, tail's done. Bring it that way. Yeah, out of me road. Thank you. Hang on to that thought. Right, we're 
I don't know if there's a short admission. Uh, the wind's picking up and we don't want the fur blowing around. Our short intermission is back. Um, we cleaned up all the fur because it was blowing away. And we're back into doing smoky still. He is contesting a fair bit because we took a short admission. Um, but he hasn't got much to go, so we'll get it all done. The wind has stopped. I don't like the fur blowing around on the ground. I'd rather put it in the bin. Better off in the bin than flying around everywhere. Get hot. All right, mate, it's all right. Now you're going the wrong way, don't you? Let me control the flip then. I'll put it where I want. I know, I know. Come on, lay down. Lay down. Give him up. He wants to stand up, let him stand up. Come up that high, please. Give him. Give me a call. That's a boy. That's better, isn't it? You don't like being on your back. See if I can get it done while you're sitting there like that. Come on. I don't think I could to go by the looks of it. Oh, little bubbly pig on the side of the street. Come on. He's going to be a bit fluffy and scraggly on the paws. But, no, it can't it'll be got, helped. It can't be helped. He's really contesting, so we're not going to try and push it too far today. And, if he's got a few scraggly ones, he's got a few scraggly ones. Not much I can do about it. I've only got his front paw here to do. Underneath. And underneath. So I'll get that done. Hey, Smoke. Yeah, you're not liking it, are you? Come on. Come on. Four to go, mate. Push it out. I'm not trying to hurt you. Totally the opposite. But as you can see in the, in the video, we can actually you can actually see that they haven't been cut at all. Um, like I said, I'm not a, not a professional or anything. I'm just trying to do the best for our our cats that we can. With the least amount of stress. I'm gonna swallow him over there. So I got that pull. Come on. I want that pull. Up here. And as you can see, he's really contesting. He's hanging on to me. He's hanging on to Jim real quick. He, he's like a like a monkey. He'll grab onto anything. Come on. No, I want you over the other way, mate. Here. Move that out of the road for a second so you can see all that. All because of one leg. <laughs> so, you get it done, mate, we mate, eh? Short break.
We already had one. Don't want another one. You only got a little bit to go. Hmm? Give you a good rub off. No, no, don't go up there. Come on, down you get. Right here. Over we go. Over we go. Lie down. Lie down. Lie down. He's really contesting now. Yeah. Yes, I know. Little bugger. Come on, Malk. Right. Yeah. Just got this little bit up here around mm. under his elbow to do. You want me to No. So probably grab my arm and I'll do that. I'll do it this way. The way I want to try and do it. Not that the people can see what I'm doing. And if I can see what's going on. Come on, there you go, I've got him now. Are you pulling up or you? No, I'm trying to pull him up. I got him back. That's the advantage of just hanging on to his fall with this, this one thing. If he wants to get out, he'll get out. And I'm holding him down. I'm glad you done Gizzy first. Because every time we get the caving, he usually wings on me. But he's a good boy. Yeah, yeah. Get on the pad. Shorten the pad up so they don't get sore feet. Turn another foot. Okay. Okay. I got him. No, I thought I had him. Okay. Lay down, I'll do him while he's standing up, though. Yeah. <laughs> you got him? Yeah, I've got the pad. Right, uh, that'll do Smokey. Um, he's really contesting. We've got most of it off, 99% yes, of it. Um, he is contesting. So, yeah. <laughs> Come here, Smoke. Come here, <laughs> mate. Let's put your harness back on. Right, put you back inside. We'll put you back inside. We'll let you have a run, probably. So that's what we've done here for today. I've got a little bit there. Once I get the harness on, I might do a little bit more actually, because I can hang. We can hang on to him a little bit better. Um, he knows that the, his harness is going on. He's trying to get away now. He's one that will get away, and but, but he, he do, but he does come back. He don't see how he's anyway. See how he's. Oh, you getting out of your harness, mate? Come on. Come on. You're in the limelight, mate. Yeah, you got to get in the limelight. See, he's totally different now that he's got his harness on. Change of a cat. Straight away. Yeah, see, I've got a little bit here and a little bit there. I'll try and get that while the harness is on. With him standing up like so. Yes, right. <laughs> There's a starter, that's it. Come back here. Come here. Come here. I don't like leaving it like that. No, it look, doesn't look nice. Funny and it's scraggly otherwise. Doesn't look like I've done a good job. But no. You can do what you can do. That'll do you, mate. That'll do you. It was only a little bit. Oh, my nose. Yeah. Right, yeah. So yeah. that's Smokey for the day. Um, yeah, good old Smoke, eh, mate? Okay. So I'll, I'll go and put him on the lead now. We've got it as a runner in the air, like a flying fox. And so he can have a run around before he actually goes inside. And, um, yeah, please, if you like our videos, like, subscribe, give us a thumbs up, a thumbs down, whichever you please. 
Um, and we'll see you in the next video. See you. Bye.